Hey folks, Justin from Tackle Tactics, in at Tackle Tactics HQ and surrounded by new gear. I'm actually surrounded by goats. So you guys may have seen the three inch baby goat from Z-Man, 10 times tough creature bait. Remember out of the packet, pop those feet apart and you'll get the most out of those two paddle feet on the back of there. So the baby goat is basically a squashed grub profile to give us a, a sort of flatter body in that grub style of profile with two large flat sections and two big paddle feet on the back. So this plastic is extremely versatile. It can be buzzed across the surface. It's already caught brim, grunter, flathead, jungle perch, sooty grunter, saratoga, a bunch of other species, lots of bass as well, uh, fished on the top, but also rigged and fished subsurface as well. So make sure you check out that how to rig and fish the Z-Man 3-inch baby goat video as well for how to rig that with what jig heads suit it and how you can fish it and that sort of thing. But the exciting news is straight away, as soon as we got the three inch baby goat here, we had you guys onto us harassing us for the goat and the billy goat. So let's have a look at those. So they have, have, they've arrived, they're on their way to stores and they look fantastic. So that's our three inch baby goat. That there is our 3.75 inch goat. So pop those feet apart. You can see those big paddle feet there. So it's gonna work awesome on the top. It's gonna to be great fish subsurface. And you can also put it as a trailer on your skirted jigs, chatterbaits, buzzbaits, uh, spinnerbaits, all those sorts of things as well. So you can see the step up in size there. So this guy, you know, great snack size, brim, flathead, freshwater estuary type plastic. If you wanna step up for a larger flathead profile, I reckon this guy is gonna be absolutely dynamite on the flatties. Also barra, jacks, mulloway, reefies, all sorts of things are gonna eat that. And that's the 3.75 inch goat. That's our middle size plastic. And then we step up from there to the big bopper and that's the 4.25 inch billy goat. Again, separate those legs and you've got those two big kicking legs. So the difference between the 3.75 and the 4.25, you can, you can really feel it in the bulk of the body and the weight of the plastic. So that's gonna give it excellent weight for casting, especially if you're just rigging it weedless on a Chinlox or a Chinlox SWS and buzzing the top for Murray Cod or Barra or some other aggressive surface feeding species. So there you go. It's a cool profile in a plastic. Uh, it's gonna be fished a stack of different ways for a stack of different species. Uh, color wise in the range, half a dozen colors to kick things off, but it's got you covered with the, you know, your pearls, the deal, so a naturally sort of color. We've got a couple of darker profile colors with a watermelon red and a hot craw. Uh, there's that bright, the green pumpkin orange, so something a bit different to show them. And also my favorite, the hot snakes. So hot snakes is an awesome color. It's got that green pumpkin-y sort of top of that, that green UV type belly. So hit that with a UV torch and that lights up. So very UV reactive, that, that hot snakes. So there you go. That's another new addition to the range that we're super pumped on. So check out the three inch baby goat, the 3.75 inch goat, and don't forget that big billy goat, especially if you're chasing barra, Murray cod, mulloway, those other larger predatory species. That's the goat, get out there, give it a go. All the best with the fishing.